The ancient dream of mankind to conquer the skies was realized when the Wright brothers landed the first powered flight in 1903. Those 12 seconds of airtime opened the door to an industry that has not only conquered the skies, but made flight a common part of modern life. In 2012 alone, more than 9.8 million international and domestic flights were taken by more than 815 million passengers into, out of, and within the United States, with each passenger averaging 1,389 miles in the air. Chances are good that you were one of them, and for all of the security checkpoints and safety routines you had to go through, there is one piece of the puzzle that gets you safely from LaGuardia to Mumbai. That's NDT. From design and manufacturing to use and service, the components of an aircraft are regularly inspected for anomalies that might compromise their integrity. Digital imaging helps detect voids in wing structures, while fluorescent liquid penetrants detect imperfections in gears. In one of our technical papers this month, on page 987, research being conducted at Southern Illinois University looks at how air-coupled ultrasonic testing can be used to identify discontinuities in carbon-carbon composite brake discs. These discs need to be able to dissipate 450 megajoules of energy to land a fully loaded jet airliner, so ensuring their quality is of critical concern. The use of NDT in this way helps to provide feedback to manufacturers to assist them in continuing to make high-quality products. Computer technology has vastly expanded the capabilities of NDT equipment. New products allow technicians to see more anomalies with greater sensitivity and detail. New systems allow data to be recorded and read easily and quickly. And as aircraft become more complex with more components, the NDT industry has been able to keep up, improving quality of results and keeping testing costs down. Thanks for watching and keep making the world a safer place.